Greetings and welcome to my channel. If you saw yesterday's video, which a good number of you did, and that really makes me happy, <laughs> uh, then you know what's going on here. Uh, I won't waste your time getting back into it. Uh, you've seen the mods we're using for this. It's going to be a largely vanilla vanilla experience, and there's, there's just a few little things to like make things a bit less cluttered. You know, a little bit, a little bit like less tedious, maybe. But that's that's about it. So yeah, let's just get into this. Uh, but, you know, as myself, um, this would be cool, but you know, I'm not I'm not your your boss or anything. <laughs> All right, so let's just get into it then. So before I do any chopping, I want to see if we have any caves to work with here. And yeah, cave right here, so it looks like we're good. Uh, and this looks like a flat enough area, I suppose. Let me get rid of this slime. I'll be needing to trade this copper broadsword out for a wooden for a copper short sword out, excuse me, for a uh, wooden broadsword as soon as I can. Just kind of clear this area out a bit. It kind of looks like I know I might want to go for that wooden broadsword sooner rather than later. Let's see here. Go. All right, have at the. Oh yeah, that's much better. Ah well. Just a flesh wound. It'll heal. Now, I'm probably going to have to make a, um, a separate, like, large hotel for all the modded NPCs because the base game of Terraria kind of has a fine balance for where it's the NPCs should go and who should be, like, you know, room, roomed up with who. Uh, or who should be neighbors with who, I guess is a better way to put that. I'm not too concerned about like what the NPCs are interested in. Maybe I'll make some homes for, uh, for the ones I know I'm going to be like spending a lot of money on like you know like the brewer like, and such. <clears throat> but for the most part I'm just going to kind of hide them away so I don't have to deal with them too much. Particularly the useless ones like this automaton that showed up. Like I don't know why you would um make an NPC just to explain how your mod works when things like the guide and the recipe browser mod exist, but, you know, I'm not a mod, I don't make mods, so I'm probably not one to judge. Alright, somebody killed a bunny, that means I have to go on a murderous rampage to avenge the poor soul. There'll be no killing of bunnies in this world if I have anything to say about it. me down for it just back to work a little bit of uh, explanation about what's going on here this is a large world because that's just what I enjoy playing with in this game like medium and small worlds just don't do it for me uh, this is also on master difficulty because mainly I wanted to get like a, 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 a museum to hold the relics of all the mosses I slay on this path kind of a little trophy room <clears throat> you know, to show off at the end of the journey. Um, and we also have Crimson. Like, this world has been cursed with Crimson. Which I prefer over Corruption, primarily for Crimson Armor, which provides life regen, which is very nice. Uh, even even though it's like a pretty hard mo mode uh, set of armor, it's not, we're not, not going to be with us very long. Especially considering the uh, powerful defense, defensive... Uh, strength of molten armor but that's like a that's not gonna be with us very long because shortly after i get that i'm probably gonna have, like going into hard mode at some point i'm definitely gonna have to get all this wood replaced for stone as well just because it's just a better material for building out of not in terms of like the game mechanics just the, like a, a taste thing which isn't saying much because uh i can tell you right now don't expect my building style to get any more like 
uh, pleasing to the eye to miss. I'm very fu function over form when it comes to building in any game. So, and I apologize in advance for that. I, and I know I was working to try to like improve that in Minecraft, but in this game, I really don't care. <laughs> so, if that displeases you, I apologize in advance, but I have no intention of changing it. Uh, let's get the workbench down. Let's get some doors. So I don't have to deal with these uh, cursed slimes. Accursed slimes, like, terrorizing, terrorizing. Or just, like, getting in the way while I work, really. Alright, there we go. This house is as good as, uh, built. The holes in the walls, I'm gonna fill in with glass. Despite the Spartan uh, nature of my build, I do like to be a little nice to my NPCs. They have, like, two chairs in each room, so they, like, they, they can visit each other. Or at least, like, the immediate neighbors can visit each other. And, uh, they also have, like, little windows so they can see the outside. I feel like that's more than most people who, who also try to go Spartan do, uh, for their NPCs. And also, these, um, these little, like, glass shafts will be used for something, but for right now, they're kind of just, like, decoration. Or will, will be when I get glass in them. I don't think, uh, they're wide enough to really allow monsters to spawn inside the house, but I guess time will tell on that. Though I've never really had a problem with that in the past. Alright, uh, it's currently raining, but the sun seems to be up. I don't see any undead lying around, so let's get out there and actually explore. This here. Okay, yeah, that's, that's good. I definitely need more torches. Uh, I'll take these. I, I guess I can sell these. And I'm definitely going to need the chest. Ooh, money. I'll take that. Oh, uh, well, this is the wrong way. Might have to fight this slime. Come on. a mistake. Yep, sure was. I did not have. There we go. Okay, I can actually see now. I don't have any glow sticks is what I was trying to say there. There we go. Get out of here. Uh, I wonder... Oh, sure enough, that creates another path back up I can use. Up. Alright, fine. Fine, go down. Excuse me. Coming through. You know, I'm just gonna them honestly get out of my way Oof. come on there we go all right oh yeah here we go oh is that some sand I see down there that's useful but I'm gonna have to save that for later right now I need to get away from these dang slimes This up and uh, what? <laughs> How do I get up here? That was weird. I know this game can be a little bit janky but sometimes, but sheesh. Go. Oh. Huh. Go. Juked. Easy. Uh, 
hey, there's some more sand. That's good to see. And it looks like this leads to the underground desert, which is good. But not now, it's not. That's just a little bit too dangerous for me at the moment. I need to get my hands on some, uh... Oh, no! Gear made of fine metal. Oh, slow down there, chief. Right, there we go. Let's pop this here. Alright. Okay, well, that's a little aggravating. Yeah, and so is that. That slime just took all my gold. Yay. Oh, yeah, this is the uh, sand pit I saw earlier. Go ahead and start. Oh, well, I kind of can't do that right now with all the sodding slimes here. Oh, hey, there's the. There's the rat that took all my money. I'll be taking that back now, thank you very much. Uh, or maybe I won't. Well, alright. This is frustrating. Yep. Okay, you know what? Let's take a range approach. As much as I can, anyway. That. <sighs> Not doing that either, if I can help it. Don't appreciate all the jellyfish spawning in these tiny ponds. I don't know if I have to walk all this way. You don't have to increase the difficulty of me getting to where my money is. Okay, well. Come on! Where I could throw shurikens at you. One down. There we go. Give me my money. Now on that note, I'm gonna take my own advice and probably die trying to get back to base. Not really smart, smart to pop my only recall potion, but. I'm gonna put this money somewhere where it'll stick around. Wait, what am I doing? I have a piggy bank. There we go. There we go. And with that, I can acquire a few more necessities. What? Not that. This. It might be a bit foolish to buy the pylon this early, but, uh, trust me, it'll have its uses, although I don't intend to put it down right now. I'm going melee, uh, if it isn't already obvious, so I don't really in intend to make use of these, uh, Fallen Stars, but better to have and not need, I guess. Okay, now it's just a regular squirrel, okay. There you go. In the light of the sunflowers, I thought it was a golden squirrel, but nah. Thank goodness the jellyfish aren't around anymore. Don't worry, have to be, don't worry, have to worry about being zapped to death by them. That'll do. A life crystal. I might have to go up here to get to it. 
Alright, replacement for my recall potion, that's nice. Oh, oh, nah, yeah, I'm getting this five crystal, shut up. Cut. Okay, let's juke him. Yep, well, let's juke him. There we go, first life crystal to run. Feels good. Got some emeralds. That's good. We need that. Oh we have here. All right, Hermes boots boots out of the uh, first gold chest. Real nice. That extra three def or sorry two defense is going to be useful too. This grab this for decoration. Grab some shine potions so I can go easy on the torches. And some more recoil potions are always nice. Speaking of, let's back that. Oh, <laughs> gotta watch my breath. There we go. Painting sell fairly well, so I'll grab that as well. Oh, hey, another life crystal, too. That's nice. There we go. Ooh, okay. Definitely need those. No. Uh, let's take these bombs before I throw them. Just to be on the safe side. Torches probably, yeah. We'll just, uh. This is concerning. Some more gelatinous repscallions standing between me and riches that I came down here to acquire. Okay, well, that didn't work as planned. Alright, well, let's juke them. Get up here. Okay, good. We have platinum, but I don't. I'm not gonna get it. Yeah, ah. Not fast enough with that recall potion. I'll let you give some of that to me. Oh, I could not have chosen a better time to make me some, uh... A better weapon, because we have, we're dealing with this now. Come on up, buddy. There you go. Taste the bite of my sword now. Don't be shy. I dealt some damage to me, but I dealt some right back to you. Come on. There you go. Get out of here. And of course, he drops a joke item. Keep your distance, you... Blights on reality. Alright. Yeah, this might just be my opinion, but gold is really best suited for coins. Though I don't mind having platinum coins, is it? Well, of course. Oh, campfire. That'll be useful later. Uh, some more shurikens. Health potions. No recall potions. Torches. Silver coins. And some shoe spikes. Useful, but... Don't forgive me for hoping for more. In quality, I mean. Like something like a better weapon or maybe a banner region or something still i'm not one for looking gift horses in their mouths i'll take what i can get oh oh that's great that's just what i need well so much for this path i am not braving spider caves not right now anyway I wonder. Huh. I guess my assumption about uh, this being or leading to the uh, underground desert was off. Unfortunately, but, uh, I'm sure I'll find my way there eventually. <sighs> or wait, I don't think I have have a reason to go there in, uh, Vanilla Terraria. Other than to get the golfer, maybe, and 
hope to find some good stuff in the treasure chest there, but... Eh, it doesn't matter. It's way too dangerous to go there now. Let's see here. Let's see, yeah, let's see if this is a base of operations. You know the bloody worm. Alright, I meant to use the shurikens. Well... We may well be dealing with yet another night indoors. That sucks. I'll be back, I suppose. Later. Okay, well, I had the bright idea to think, oh, I should wait until I get to the caves to start a recording. And then immediately fail to do so. <laughs> Once I actually started making a bit of progress. Uh... I've got a decent amount of lead and silver. The silver I'm going to need for storage compartment for, for the storage system. I'm going to need a lot more of it than I'm going to need the, the lead, so I can maybe get a, a bit of lead armor going. But I don't. Part of me kind of wants to just wait for platinum, but I don't know if that's feasible. I'm also one emerald shy of making the uh, the primary component for the magic storage system. So even though I have a uh, 10 silver bars and a storage component ready to go, can't really get anything going in, uh, in regards to that just yet. Might as well just sell the little cushion. Yeah, I'm not a multiplayer. And I also died with like 5 gold on me, so that's absolutely marvelous. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna mute that. Don't want that zombie banging on the door, like, messing up with my ending. But, yeah, I uh, didn't get a whole lot done today. I was kind of hoping to, like, have at least, like, platinum armor by the end of the first episode. But I think it's fair to say that I just underestimated Master Mode. <laughs> I'm looking forward to where this series goes. And I, I hope you are, too. I hope, you're, I hope you're, you've been enjoying watching this. And I hope I'm able to make this series more enjoyable as time goes on. But, you know, uh, only time can tell with that sort of thing. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you in the next one. Farewell.